tonight. The world is watching as Ukraine braces for a full-scale invasion of Russian troops, as we may be hours away from the beginning of the bloodiest conflict in Europe since World War II. There will be suffering, there will be sacrifice, and all of that must and should be laid at his feet. The Pentagon warning almost all of Putin's 190,000 troops are in combat-ready positions as Ukraine declares a state of emergency and the U.S. moves reinforcements into the region. Plus our interview with the Secretary of State and tensions overseas lead the Dow to close at its lowest level of the year. Winter hazards, snow, ice and high winds cause flight cancellations nationwide. We're tracking the storm. Target lifts its mask mandate. Shoppers and employees no longer need to cover their faces in the superstore. Long COVID, the scary link between the coronavirus and heart problems like stroke and heart attacks. Honoring our heroes. Tonight we visit the Pentagon to find out why so many veterans have trouble finding a job after serving our country and the organization trying to help. That was great. And Byron Allen, the media mogul's bid to become the NFL's first black majority team owner. This is the CBS Evening News with Nora O'Donnell, reporting from the nation's capital. Good evening to our viewers in the West, and thank you for joining us. We're going to begin tonight with much of the world on high alert, waiting and dreading that Vladimir Putin and his Russian forces are ready to conduct a full-scale invasion of Ukraine. Up to 100.